session we are discussing the palpation and treatment of first and second rib we just started so patient is in a supine position you can do it in a sitting position as well not a problem but i like to do it in a supine position okay take the upper trapezius muscle belly back go 45 degree medial and inferior just compare the static position first okay static position and now then ask the patient to take a deep breath in sir breathe out i am feeling for it you can ask patient to do this couple of times deep breath in breathe out do you have any pain on the left or the right side sir or just the pressure pressure that's it in case if i think the left side is bothering him okay so i like to start the rib mobilization first and then i can do the mini ribs pe kaun si muscle attach hoti hai scalenes scalenes which can lead to the problem in the neck so agar mujhe left side ki first rib uh, treat karni hai to mujhe neck ko kahan pe side bend karna padega muscles ko relax karne ke liye same side flexion same side correct ipsilateral side flexion opposite side rotation so what i do is ipsilateral side flexion and contralateral rotation that's it pura nahi karna hai now here only he started contracting his sternocleidomastoid see this muscle belly he started contracting his sternocleidomastoid please relax your muscles sir so if the patient is contracting the sternocleidomastoid i tell them to relax now what you were telling okay we do the same thing we use a web space take the upper trapezius muscle belly back okay this is the position one hand is stabilizing the neck okay and one hand is providing the force towards the opposite hip isko rat lo ghot lo first rib mein we provide the force towards the opposite hip so the technique looks something like this i'm doing just the mobilization take a deep breath in sir breathe out when he breathes out because the first rib was stuck in expiration so i'm trying to help the first rib mobilize down so towards the opposite hip please take a deep breath in sir breathe out this way now your technique should be comfortable to the patient because this is a sensitive area you can't poke it okay excuse me that's why you have to use your web space okay please take a deep breath in sir breathe out and when he breathes out i push it in now the second part is when he starts taking a deep breath in i hold that mobilization over there take a deep breath in <coughs> breathe out i provide more force when he breathes out towards the opposite hip and i hold it over there when he takes a deep breath in take a deep breath in i hold it there i am not letting the rib go